quick a orcs and goblins update the army is just about done actually the army itself is done i'm just doing some uh fine tuning here and there and uh i got a lot of work to do i'm taking tomorrow off of work to finish up my display board and that's all i have left to do uh let me talk about what's going on with my orcs and goblins uh came up with a great idea actually i didn't come up with the idea but uh one of my gaming pals did and that was I was complaining about I didn't have a uh, foot of gork template and I needed to make one and he suggested why not make a snowshoe and so I did so if you've seen you've probably seen the uh, beginning picture on the blog if you read that um, let me show you how I finished it up well, just a second let me move the camera okay here you go one snowshoe of gork as I like to call it, uh, because it's going to be used for the Foot of Gork template, so I'm just going to rename the spell the Snowshoe of Gork. Uh, this is just some plastic card. I tried to use some some wood soaking in water, but it was just taking way too long, and it would have taken way too long to dry, so I just had to go with plastic card and just give it a faux wood paint job. Just like I use with all my skis and stuff. Uh, these, this is actual twine here I had happened to have in my toolbox, and these knots here are actually from snowshoe um, stringing. I caught some videos on YouTube on how to string snowshoes and duplicated the knots. So these are authentic snowshoe knots on how they uh, attach the webbing to the outside edges. I thought that was kind of cool. Uh, but this kind of got me thinking on theming my army so I just kind of ran with it. And what I've done is I decided to go ahead and call my orcs the, the Icy Orcs Clan of Gork Snowshoe. And so I needed a uh, I didn't need this, but this is what I made for them. Nice little sword. This will go on the back of the display board. Clan of Gork snowshoe and the snowshoe template just hangs nicely. Right there, so it's going to be standing up. Ooh, removed. It's going to be stamp on the back of the display board. And what did I do for display board? Well, of course, I just duplicated the snowshoe. Hold on just one second. Let me change the camera around again. So this is it, this is my in progress, a snowshoe shaped display board, um, exact same shape and dimensions as my template. I just lined this up to the grid on my cutting mat and uh, this is exactly a 10 times the size. Uh, the template is 4x2 so this was cut out of a 40x20 piece of foam and I just duplicated all the shapes, the sizes and all the locations. Um, this is of course apple barrel paint I started on here but it's really hard to get into these temples so I'm going to have to use the airbrush on it. I tried to use the brush on it tonight and uh, with various degrees of success. So it's just going to get airbrushed tomorrow. can't do it now because everyone's asleep. Um, so this is all I have left to do. Get this pounded, painted brown, dry brush, and get some snow flock on it. And that will finish up the army. Everything else is done. So as soon as everything is done, I'll then put a video together showing the army and what I'm taking. Uh, I have a couple other things to add to it. I do have a unit of archer goblins in there, so I'm going to put the goblins uh, on this end of the board, facing to the side, and they're going to have something to shoot at, and of course they're going to be shooting at snowmen. So I'm going to have two snowmen targets for my uh, goblin archers. I'll probably put, grab some paper clips or something to make arrows sticking in them, but these will be sitting on the edge of the board. Uh, and then this will go, well, it's actually the back of the board, so this is going to go about something like this right here. And that'll be my display board for my room. This is actually just barely big enough to get everything fitting in well. So that's about it. That's uh, my progress in the Orcs and Goblins. I said tomorrow after I get everything all done, I'll break out the army and make a video showcasing everything I'm taking. And uh, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.